Hey guys, what's going on? DuffKing56 here, back to continue our Let's Play of Yakuza 0. Welcome, welcome back. If you remember last time, I actually completed quite a bit of main story. I was fighting my way through the Tojo HQ, and I got the okay as a do not touch. I'm a protected citizen now in Kamurocho because I was bought, or at least the rights to me were bought by Tachibana for 1 billion yen from the Tojo acting manager himself, the, C the CEO, man, he was the leader. But anyways, we're coming back here because now it's time for us to head over to Sotenbori. Now that might sound weird to you, but that's exactly what's going to happen. So let us continue on, go to the Chen restaurant in Little Asia. We're going to meet up with Oda and Tachibana and head to Sotenbori. Now let's actually see if that actually happens. I'm much more curious as to if that's going to be a real thing or something is going to happen along the way that'll be a twist or a turn. But we're back in Little Asia, and we have our directive, so we will continue and do just that to continue the main story. Yo, Kiryu-kun. Yo, Kiryu-kun. Kiryu of course you're going to skip town. Let's head to Sotenbori. Yeah, uh, it's そうか。よし、それじゃあ入ってくれ。中で社長が待ってる。お待ちしてました、キリさん。あなたが総天堀に行く前に空の一つぼの持ち主について うちと協力関係にある、とある組織に格まわれています。協力関係にある組織。その組織については後で小田さんから説明してもらいます。ただ、どちらにしろ大阪は大見連合の日座元、長い時間格まえるものじゃありません。ですから、空の一つぼの所
and some other interesting fellows are looking for Makoto Makimura over in Sotenbori. And here we go. ウラ社会の複数勢力から標的とされる牧村誠彼女が狙われる理由を探る真島は誠の面倒を見てきた中国人のハリ氏リーに見込まれるリーはかつて大陸系組織に雇われるコロシアでもあった誠を守ろうと
あの牧村誠を盗んでいった泥棒猫を始末しねえとな。あの泥棒猫、蒼天堀じゃ見ない顔だったな。もしかしてマジマちゃんの古いお友達知らんわ、ね、あんなやつ。うん。なんでどいつもこいつもあの女のことを狙っとんのや。あいつは売春の元締めなんかしとらん。あないな小娘に一体何の価値があんのや。知りたい。教えたくても教えらんないな俺だって知らねえんだからよはあ真島を使って牧村誠という人間を殺せってそれだけだからな俺が兄弟から聞いてる話は兄弟そしたら女殺せっちゅうのは島野の,の島野の,の親父からの命令なんかそうだからこそお前を登場会に戻してやれるチャンスなんだよなんで親父は俺にやらせようとしたんやさあなそれは俺にもわかんねえとにかく白スーツの男本当に心当たりないんだなああせやけど気になることはあるうんやつは女を奪って生きよったが殺そうとしてるようには見えへんかったそれは西谷も同じやんちょっと待って西谷ってグランドで暴れた鬼人会のか西谷はあの時別の死体を用意した代わりに牧村誠を渡せ言うてきたあの子を殺すつもりやったらそないめんどくさいことはせんやろ西谷が別の死体を用意おかしいな初耳だなまあ西谷と白いスーツの男が同じ目的ってことは分かったってことはやつら来るかもしれないなありうる話やどっかで拾ってきた野良を泥棒猫に仕立てたってわけか確かに西谷らしい手口だなそうなりゃ西谷を叩いて女の居所を吐かせたいとこだな札にしょっぴかれて今頃留置所かいや、西谷やなくても、組員もいろいろ知っとるふうやった。お前は、何も分かっとらん。あの女の、価値を。はあ。そしたら、組員からたどれ。基人会の事務所は、蒼天堀通り東の、第三並木ビルってのに入ってる。確か3階だったはずだ。分かったマジマちゃんさ西谷のこと以外に俺に隠し事ないよねあらへんはあもしも何か隠し事してたら殺す言いたいんやろ分かってきたねマジマちゃん Now, I'm really glad that Sakawa had the opportunity to eat some shit in that part of the story. However, now I'm very sad because Majima is really in a bit of a pickle, and that is very unfortunate for us here. Because we got ourselves beat up, and now we are down in the eyes of pretty much everybody where we are trying to get back to. So, of course, this is exactly where we are trying to go for the main quest area. However, I do. Want to go to a park here because in this Ashitaba Park area, there is a very, very interesting sub story that I've been dancing around, and I know I would rather go and do the main quest here. However, I did say that the second I came back and had the opportunity to play as Majima, I would go and do this quest, especially since it involves the writing on the bathroom wall. Now, that might not seem very interesting to you. Or all y'all, but that's okay. I think it will net us something interesting because when else do you get to write shit on the wall of a bathroom and shit gets to be like, I don't know, going crazy for you. So, 
Got some bikers to smack up here with our bat, and that is just fine with me. Beautiful here. Can hit them all. We have 38 million, which is great. That means we can probably try to get some upgrades eventually. Good. Okay. Ooh, okay. I didn't think I'd get taken down there. That's okay. <laughs> I'm not too worried about it. Just keep smacking you when you're on the ground. I want to see how many guys I actually have to kill with the baseball bat still, the style, because as much as I like it, I actually still want to upgrade my bat if that's even possible. Come on, buddy. There we go. Oh, okay. Well, I wasn't quite expecting all that to happen. Oh my gosh, please. There we go. Ow, man, that hurts. Now I'm gonna hurt you. They don't call it a pummel and bat for nothing, man. Very unfortunate for you, but it also lines my pockets with a little bit of cash. And Murakami here can suffer the same fate. <laughs> That's the only thing we can really do. So now we're back in the park. What do we got here, man? We've got a random guy that we can go- Oh no, that's the, um, that's the weapons guy, the kung fu guy, but we're actually here to go back to the bathroom and right back on the wall here. Yes, let's check out what the graffiti says. Oh hell, why not? Of course, man. What you got for us? What you writing down on there? We'll find out after this flush. <laughs> I offered to chat with the lonely lady. Ain't right for anyone to feel alone in the world. Very true. A new line of scribble. What do you like? Oh, okay, well, I wear a suit at work, I'm a sex craze, crazed perv, or my physique's the real deal. These are all kind of good, but I kind of want to write my physique's the real deal. Um, maybe not. I don't know, man. There's so many good options here. Um, there's only three of them, but all of them are good options to me. I'm going to go with my physique's the real deal. <laughs> See if uh, she wants to find us after a word like that there. Okay, so we have dropped our reply. We could talk to him and learn a new combat skill, probably. You know what? I think I actually might be worth it. And then I will take a break and go to the next episode. I think that would be kind of cool, don't you think? Let's see what this guy has to teach us here. It ain't no breakdance move, of course. But we want to learn some Komeki ways here. What do you have here for us? Oh, sparring with Komeki. Okay, so that is the sub story that we need to do. So let's do the first one here. The warrior arts would probably be for the best. Secret arts used in the school of fighting. Test my metal with them. I guess that's okay. What are these warrior arts though? What are you trying to teach me, Mr. Komeki? Okay, I guess yelling. Oh, is this like a taunt? Oh, okay. Upgrade our abilities here. Continue our... That's it? That's it? Seriously? Whoops, I want to uh, look at my abilities here. That's rather unfortunate. Let's actually go and upgrade some stuff here. Probably is for the best. I do want to upgrade my health. I know it's asking a lot and it's using a lot of money. But that's okay, right? I mean, small price to pay for good upgrades for us here. Just charge up all the way that we possibly can. Get two in every ability sounds fair, right? Then we'll go back and try to talk to him with our arts. Slugger, I'm not really too sure that I care too much about that. Charge Windmill might be good because it's a new attack for us, as well as the break roll. Okay, Phantom Turn. Oh, that's interesting. Looks like we can dodge a little bit better here. Ooh, and a Spinning Rotor would definitely be a good idea for an attack to upgrade for us here. And this seems like a taunt here, right? The White Tiger's Spirit. And this boosts our health, so that's good. Alright, so we, we basically exhausted a lot of our cash here. We'll go and grab some Slugger abilities here. I think that would be fair, right? I don't mind getting a Hold Attack for us. I don't really need a Running Assault right now, but I do... I would like some extra health. That's definitely something I would not mind. Okay, so we've upgraded pretty much all that we need to do here. Let's go back and talk to Komek here. Alright, let's see. We are ready. What do you got for us here? Warrior Arts. What are you going to teach me? Is it just going to be a fight? 
I'm not actually sure. Oh, okay. It is just a fight. There we go. This is a guard break, so it's something. There we go. Ooh, okay. Those heat gauges do a lot to him. Ooh, a thug style move. Precise strike is unleash after a quick step. Oh, okay. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, I see. I, I, I thought I'm in the thug style, right? Ow. Oh, I see. Okay. I thought it was, um... I thought I was pressing the X button when I wasn't. Oh my god, please just get off my dick. Oh, come on, that hurts, man. There we go. Oh, come on, just two more and then I just have to finish the fight. I probably should just lock on to him, don't you think? Probably would be for the best here. There we go. Okay, you don't need to combo me up like that. There we go, okay. Oh my god, man. All right, we need to actually heal up here. That's that's not very nice what he just is doing to us here. <laughs> so let's heal back some health. Oh my god, man. Okay, that hurts. He just quick steps so much. There we go, okay. There we go, alright. That's all we needed to do there to learn some warrior arts. My gosh. I'm not the best at combat with my fists, that is. <laughs> oh boy. I think he's gonna get better as we go, as he said, he's, he's still coming around with his thing. Alright, I'll take the warrior art though, that is definitely good. Oh, okay, we got our eva evasion strike here. And substory number num number 95, sparring with Komeki, is ended. Of course there are more moves for us to get, and we can get those as we go. There's only four more, which is not that big of a deal, but I will catch you guys in the next episode when we finish off this bathroom thing, I hope at least, and then we will go right to the main story to figure out what's going on with Makoto. So this has been Duffking56 with our Let's Play of Yakuza 0. Catch you guys next time. Peace out.